Hey entertainers, it's Brian Foley. I'm in uh, Tempe, Arizona, which is a suburb of Phoenix, Arizona, and this is my studio from where I do Zoom shows, streaming shows, recording shows for um, uh, the three characters that I offer. I've got a kid show, a kid show comedy superstar, Mr. B. I have a Harry Potter themed show. Uh, that's Professor Wigglebottom's Traveling Magic School. And then I do a show called M&M with my partner up in Canada. It's called M&M, so it's magic and mime. I do the magic and she does the mime. And then we kind of make fun of each other a little bit. It's really fun. So I thought I would show you how I'm making this succeed and have been making it succeed since March of 2020. So this is what we do. Sometimes it gets hot, sometimes it gets cold, but I'm going to show you exactly how we do it right here. Stay tuned. So here's the deal. We are in my garage. There's my garage door opener. All right. This is where we are. We're in the garage. I have uh, taped off the windows. Uh, one of them fell down, but that's okay because it's not summertime right now. Um, when it's summertime in Phoenix, Arizona, I need to keep out the sun and I need to keep out the heat. All right. Because that makes it. So this is just a little black wrap, a little uh, Roscoe brand uh, black wrap that I've put up on the windows. And then I'll just show you what I do. This is great. So I've got my, my pipe and drape set up. I just need to make sure that the uh, laundry is not running while I'm doing these shows. Uh, so I have my pipe and drape and uh, my, my camera is sometimes it's my phone, sometimes it's my iPad, uh, depending how we want to stream. All right. But I found that if I just, you know, shut down uh, all the other apps, the phone and the iPad, they work great for streaming shows. It's simple. They're things that I already have. All right. And I put the investment into my time. All right. Uh, and then my phone is actually just sitting on a music stand. So we've got a music stand here. Uh, my, my wife has one of those uh, fancy like ring light uh, stands for phones. I don't use it. I just set my stuff on a, um, on a music stand. And honestly, honestly, if I want to really secure it, I just take some rubber bands or elastic and I stretch it over the whole thing. Uh, that way it covers up the screen a little bit. I don't cover the camera, but I cover the screen because, you know, I have the tendency like I am right now. I'm looking at the screen, but I should be looking at you. All right. So I make sure that if I'm covering the screen, at least partially, it reminds me to look at the camera. In terms of lights, oh man, I've got some really great things. So this, I just turned it off, but it's a Husky. This is a Husky work light, all right? It folds up, it comes with a stand. This thing cost me about 60 bucks. And I, as you can see, I taped some gel to it. I've got some cool gels on the sides and some warm gels in the middle. And when I turn that thing on, Sometimes I even need to diffuse it for certain shows. So I can just uh, check it with, you know, move distance back and forward, uh, back and forth. And this gives me exactly what I need. Now I also have a clip light over here with a warm gel and some diffusion in it. And that's just, that's just sitting on a chair that I use for my uh, vaudeville shows. Uh, it allows me to set some props over there and it gives me just a little bit more light. I'm kind of turning these off as I go because I'm all done here and I don't want to waste any more electricity. And then for the curtain, you see now we've got, definitely have some light on the curtain. And I have more, I've just got my garage lights on right now, which normally I wouldn't have on. But you see, I've got these 24 inch fantastic strip lights. These are the best little LED strip lights. I got these from rainbowlightsus.com. Uh, these, uh, I've used these on so many gigs. And I gotta admit that I love, love, love these lights. So um, they are rechargeable. Let me see if I can get this so you can see. Um, so they are, uh, they're rechargeable. Um, I've got them on power right now because they weren't recharged and I need to get them recharged for a gig that I have coming up. So, um, and they go, th they've got like 30 different colors. So they have UV. I bought them for their UV capabilities when I was doing a UV gig um, and I would just charge them at night and they would last like four nights in a row, these four hour gigs. I had a whole month of four hour UV gigs and I would just turn them on. They were great. They were so fantastic. Um, so uh, it's a US based company and I'm really, really happy with these lights. So I use them for juggling backlight. I use them for side light. I use them for light on the curtains. Um, and if I'm shooting inside against my um, stone, of my, uh, uh, what's that called? <laughs> fireplace, fireplace. Cause sometimes I do the Harry Potter show in there. Um, I can put green or purple lights uh, on the fireplace and it looks really magical. It really looks like Hogwarts. So it's really great. And these have been serving me really, really well. Um, and then these red curtains and the, the uh, pipe and base uh, I got from online EEI. And I got these when I lived in New York the, many years ago. Um, this was maybe 2006, 2007 when I bought these and I've been using them nonstop. What I love about these is that the pipes, they break down in the middle. I don't know if you can see, but there's a little seam 
right there. There we go. There's a seam. So these split in half, and these will fit in the back of a car, a regular car. So even though I've got about 9 or 10 feet in height, they just fit in the back of the car. Um, so super easy, super fun. I am hoping to upgrade at some point to, uh, uh, you know, one of those pop-up expandable uh, backdrops with the uh, Velcro on front. That's in the future. It's not now. You got to be fiscally responsible during quarantine. Um, so that's what I got going on. Uh, we're in the garage. I just need to make sure that, you know, nobody's taking a shower. Uh, but if we, you know, we work it out. We make it happen. And sound is pretty good. Light is pretty good. It's a nice controlled environment. And it works for me. All right. Uh, and most people who are uh, kid show performers have a garage. All right. If I can do it, you can do it. Lots of love. Stay safe. Stay healthy. I'm Brian. Check me out at vvphx.com. Or you can check me out on Instagram. All right. Bye.